hello again, and welcome back to FSD TV. I'm your host, Mark Sunny, and today we have a great science lesson for you taught by Melanie Reich, and she's going to talk a little bit about understanding the water cycle and how it affects all of us. So, Melanie, show us how. Hello, everyone. My name is Miss Reich, and today we're going to be learning about the water cycle. For this lesson, you're going to be able to use common household items such as a Ziploc bag, a cup of water, permanent marker and some tape okay so you're going to be able to get your bag your permanent marker and I want you to draw some clouds and your Sun and I'll let you continue to work on that but while you're working on that another word for the water cycle is the hydrologic cycle hydro is a Greek root word known as water so for example if you hear the word hydroflask or hydrate, it is referring to water. And today we're going to be learning about three key words that will help us understand the water cycle. The first one is evaporation, when a liquid turns into a gas. The second one is condensation, when a gas turns back into a liquid. And last, precipitation, when waterfall falls back down to the earth. This can also happen through hail or snow. Okay friends, by now you should have finished drawing your cloud and your sun. You're going to open up your bag. You're going to get your cup of water and pour it in. Try not to spill. And then you're going to zip it up. So right now you're making a model of your water or sea water with your cloud and your sun. What you're going to do next is you're going to get your piece of tape and you're going to find a nearby window, preferably one that is also exposed to the sun when it's out. From there, you're going to record your observation uh, every two to three hours for about one or two days. And from there, you'll be able to see your very own water cycle happen. Okay, friends, now that we're in the middle of our lesson, what we're going to do next is we're going to learn a TikTok inspired dance. So please make sure you have a safe space around you so you can start moving. Okay, we're going to be using our three vocabulary words to help us understand the water cycle. So first I want you to start having your feet together and you're going to start making like this water movement with your arm. But you're going to do it with your two arms and you're going to make it look like this. You're going to do it two times, okay? So one, two, from there you're going to go three, four. Okay, and so then we're gonna say, the water cycle is a, from there you're going to put your hands on your belly, sensation, like ta-da! Let's try that again. One, two, three. The water cycle is a sensation. Nice job. Okay, let's move on. Let's learn. Okay, let's learn. What you're going to do is you're going to bring your arm in like this. You're going to imagine it twisting from inside to outside. Okay, so let's try that again. Here, in, and out. Nice job. So let's learn about the water particle. And then you're going to go operation. Let's try that from the beginning. The water cycle is a sensation. Let's learn about the water particle operation. Nice job. Okay, we're going to move on. So you go from here. You're going to get ready to twist your body. So the, you're going to go on your tippy toes, the sun, and you're going to move your weight over here to the other side. Okay? Operation. The sun turns water into vapor. You're going to raise the roof. Evaporate. Okay, let's try that again from operation. The sun turns water into vapor evaporate. Okay, let's try that from the beginning. The water cycle is a sensation. Let's learn about the water particle operation. The sun turns water into vapor evaporate. Nice job. Okay. Now we're going to move on into condensation. This is, I would say, the most complicated part of the dance, but you guys got this. You're going to put your hands together. You're going to go up and then flip it upside down. Okay? One, two. From there, 
you're going to go straight down. You're going to bend at your wrists and go straight down and then lift it up like this. It looks kind of funny like this, right? Let's try that again. Up, down, bend your wrist and up. So it should go one, two, three, four. From there, you're going to make a little box like this. I'm going to try that again. Box, box, okay? One, two, three, four, five. From there, you're going to wiggle your fingers and make them go inside. And if you want, you can tilt your head like this too. Okay, the words go, condensation turns gas to a liquid. Okay, let's try that again. Condensation turns gas to a liquid. Nice job, let's add that on from the beginning. Okay, five, six, seven, eight. The water cycle is a sensation. Let's learn about the water particle operation. The sun turns water into vapor, evaporate. Condensation turns gas to a liquid. Nice job, we're almost done. You're gonna go up and down. If you wanna tilt your head too, you can. Like this. So water falls down, precipitation, and then you're going to end with our very first move. The water cycle is a sensation. Okay, let's try that. From the very beginning, really slow. The water cycle is a sensation. Let's learn about the water particle operation. The sun turns water into vapor, evaporate. Condensation turns gas to a liquid. Water falls down, precipitation. The water cycle is a sensation. Nice job. Okay, we're gonna do it one more time, a little bit faster, okay? Five, six, seven, eight. The water cycle is a sensation. Let's learn about the water particle operation. The sun turns water into vapor, evaporate. Condensation turns gas to a liquid. Water falls down, precipitation. The water cycle is a sensation. Awesome, great job guys. That is the end of our lesson. My name is Miss Reach. We would love to see your dance moves. If you can share it with FST using the hashtag FST learns. Uh, thank you so much. Again, my name is Ms. Reish. Thank you, Melanie, for that great lesson. And I think we could actually call that a rain dance. All right, on behalf of myself and everyone here at the FSD TV studios, I'm Mark Sunny, and have a great day.